If you see that one vac vacant building, it's easy to be like, oh, well, there's just a string of them. Nestled in between graffiti, no trespassing signs, and empty storefronts is Isa Han Hun's restaurant. I've had quite a few people comment about how it makes them uncomfortable to walk by, especially at night. While Jerusalem Market on Elm is a popular spot. You can get hummus or tabbouleh or a potato salad or yogurt dip. Han Han and former Greensboro Mayor Robbie Perkins think business would be better if something was done with these vacant buildings. I just see graffiti. I see dirty, I see uh, empty. Uh, it, it, it just it, it, it kind of deflates the momentum that we should have in our downtown. Perkins is now a commercial real estate broker with a vested interest in growing Greensboro. It is, in my view, uh, going to be the future of our city. We're either going to fail or we're going to succeed based on the health and the vitality of our downtown. He says the first step is getting the property owners to renovate and fill these buildings. What kind of incentives can we give for these buildings to be restored? Impose penalties to get them to want to do something positive with the buildings. Both men say it'll be a team effort to get Greensboro where it should be. The more the merrier. We need more businesses because still people forget that downtown is a real like area to come and shop. But it has to be done soon. We don't do those two things. Ten years from now, somebody else will be talking to you right here about these three empty storefronts.